Welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I am filming another what I eat in a day video. This one is what I eat in a day in a calorie deficit, which means like how I eat to like lose a few pounds here or there. I'm not in a strong deficit. So that means that I won't lose weight like quick or anything like that. And it's just a few pounds, you know, um, not too bothered if I'm completely honest with you, but I am tracking my calories using my fitness pal. So just bear that in mind when you're watching this video that this is in a calorie deficit, like what I'm eating today. What I eat in this video is actually a little bit more in a deficit than I would normally be. Like I would normally eat a tad bit more than what I ate today, but every day is different and I just eat when I'm hungry. Some days I go over the calories that I kind of allowed myself for the day because if I'm hungry, I'm hungry. Um, so yeah, I'm not restrictive in any way when it comes to my diet, but today's video is in a calorie deficit. So I thought I would just point that out. So hopefully you enjoy the video. Give it a thumbs up if you wanna see more like this and um, enjoy. So for breakfast today, I decided to make two poached eggs on toast and have a coffee with it. I always have a coffee in the morning. I don't know, it just gives me a little bit of energy and I just wake up looking forward to my coffee. So that's what I decided to have for breakfast today. And also eggs are really, really filling, which is why I like to have them in the morning. So I do my toast, add a little bit of butter and then pop the two eggs on top. I also add a little bit of salt and pepper on top as well, just to kind of add to the flavor. And this is what my breakfast looks like when it's finished. As you can see, my coffee is there on the side as well. Now for lunch, I decided to have pesto pasta. I got 50 grams of pasta, added a little bit of salt and also some boiling water to the pan. 50 grams isn't a lot, but I wasn't actually that hungry because my breakfast filled me up quite a lot and I drained it in the sink as well. Does not look very good. I also added this into a Tupperware box instead of a bowl because I've been using all of my bowls for baking brownies that day. So we're making do with this today. I added some pesto. This is just pesto that I get from Lidl and I think I added like a big teaspoon and then gave it a mix around. This is what it looks like when I finished a very simple meal. And then after I had this, I did have a little chocolate chip biscuit. Also, I drink a couple of these bottles of water a day. Now for my evening meal, I decided to make like a corn bolognese type thing. Um, so I got my rice in the bowl. I actually used 50 grams of rice, added a little bit of salt and the instructions said to add the sauce that I'm using and to warm that up before I add the corn in. I'm eating vegetarian at the minute or like nine times out of 10 I am. So this was my first time using corn and I actually kind of liked it. So I'm very happy about that. This is the sauce that I've got. It's just a random sauce that I picked up from the shop. And this is my corn that I'm using. I really actually do like this and I definitely think that I could go full vegetarian because meat does not bother me in the slightest. And this is me mixing it in. Obviously it is frozen, so you have to, you know, cook it for about 10 minutes, it said on the back of the packaging and let it simmer. I did add a little bit of water into the mixture as well, just to make the sauce a little bit more, like less thick. And also I've got my pot watcher there. He looks so cute, doesn't he? And this is what the mixture kind of looked like just before I was about to serve it. So as you can see, I did add like a little bit more water. I've also got my little meal prep kind of boxes ready because this serves four. And I am finished. This is my evening meal, my tea for the night. I also had a brownie that I'd made earlier and I'd added a little bit of ganache on top of it um, just for extra flavour. And then the only thing that I had was a cup of tea for that day. So that's everything that I ate today. So that is the end of today's video of me eating in a calorie deficit, what I would eat in a typical day. Every single day is completely different so please bear that in mind that every day is 
very different and this is just one of those days i will be filming more of these videos if you want to see them so subscribe and like this video if you want to see more what i eat in a days because i kind of like to film them like i did today where i just film like little clips and then i just overlay like a voiceover with them so let me know if you prefer it in a vlog or if you prefer it like how i've done it today um but yeah please give the video a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you in my next video, which will be on Friday at 9am for a March Feelings, Favourites and Fails. See you then. Goodbye. <laughs>